I got involved in this position in 2005 when the governor's office called and asked if I would run for state treasurer. Now you've heard me tell you what my background is. I kind of tapped the phone and said, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm not a banker. I'm not a CPA. I'm not a real deep, in-depth kind of financial background. And the voice at the other end of the phone said, yeah, we know Richard, but you're a business guy. And that's what Mitch Daniels likes. And so basically my response was, if Governor Daniels wanted me, I was willing to take it on and give it a shot. Now I'll tell you, had anyone told me when I decided to run for state treasurer in 2005, the election being in 2006, if anyone had told me that, oh, by the way, Richard, let's see, while you're state treasurer, you'll be there for the biggest financial collapse in history. You will see a time of record low interest rates. And oh, yes, you will twice, as, a, as the sole plaintiff, take a case to the United States Supreme Court. I probably would have said, let somebody else do this job. Richard Murdoch, proven conservative leadership. It's time.